Let's run it back! Hey guys, what is up? Some Sun 20 or these guys another NHL 22 hockey LTP pack opening video and today we're ripping yet another X Factor pack. That is right, we have the guaranteed X Factor pack once again from the monthly sets. That is right, if we head on over to the seasonal rewards and scroll a little bit down here to the 20th, there you go, uh, we have all 20. Now, if my math is correct, you can still get the power up icon. I'm pretty sure these fall ones go until December. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. But either way, I think no matter what, no matter what you're doing, you 100% do the X Factor Choice Fact, especially at this point in the year. Quickly before we get into the pack, a lot of you guys are enjoying the videos and I really do appreciate it. But a lot of you guys aren't subscribed. Hit that subscribe button. Join the subscribers. You get so much better pack look. I promise you. Let's get into the pack. So let's, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just rip the pack. Now, last video, you guys saw me get that McKinnon and ended up buying the McDavid. I still have my base McDavid. I'm still hoping. I'm still hoping. So you know what? We'll just get straight on into it. And before I open this pack, give the video a like. That'd be awesome. I really appreciate it. Big money. No whammy. All right. One out of five. I need a Connor McDavid. I need it. All right. First one. We're going with the middle. Chat. Dumb or an L. Dumb or an L. Oh, come on. Big money. No whammy. I'm feeling an L. I'm feeling an L. Slight W. L. 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 L again. Mitch Marner, I honestly, I don't think I've ever looked at this card. He has tape, or no, he has third eye, which actually is a really good zone ability. I have so many righties, though, man. I have, I have way too many righties. I'm not going to pick, pick Mitch Marner. Not going to pick him. All right, let's let's uh, let's hit it at the end here, and let's, I'll just go like this. And then I'm going to, I'm going to go real close. I'm going to find a color. Uh, where is it? I still can't see it. Where is the card? Uh, green, wild, Kaprizov. I have a base Kaprizov. Not really a dub. People in chat are saying dub. I don't think he makes my... I mean, maybe my third line after yonger has gone, but... Not really a dub, in my opinion. He's sick. I don't know. All right. Let's do a no-look nose here. Let's do a no-look nose. Boom. No-look nose. NHL 14 is going to give me that Conor McDavid. Oh, I didn't even open one. Let me try it again. Let me try it again. All right. Here we go. Sorry. The Conor McDavid is right... Here. I got it right, chat. Right? WWW. WWW. Bang our Timmy Panarin, baby. All right. No matter what, we're, we're, we're feeling good. I have the base Panarin untradeable. We will instantly go to the 87 Panarin. I've really liked Panarin this year. I feel like making Snappy's decent. I don't really know how effective it is. But I'll take a Panarin. A Panarin's a dub. We have two more left. Two more left. We'll go no cap. No cap for Connor McDavid or Jonathan Huber. Though. That's cool. All right. Last not but least. Last but not. Last but not least. Yeah, that's correctly. All right. Cheers, chat. G Fuel Coats on. Nate McGinnis once again. All right. So you know what? At the end of the day, no matter what, we would have had a dub. We're going to pick Panarin because, like I said, Kaprizov probably doesn't make my team right now until Yager at least. Huber, though, I mean, maybe, like, I, I don't know. I feel like there's better left-handed wingers out there. And like I said, I'm instantly going to be able to upgrade to this Panarin since I have the base one for free. Um, he's really cheap to upgrade, too. Only two power collectibles. I think we, Panarin's an easy. Panarin's an easy one. All right, so here is what the team is looking like. Not, no, not only are we debuting the beautiful 87 overall, Artemi Panarin. He already got a prime time for this month. So next month, as soon as November starts, he's probably going to get another upgrade. So I'm very happy with Panarin. I don't have any of his X-Factors uh, activated at the moment. We did activate Magician. 94 Agility, 97 Deacon, 95 Puck Control. Feeling good about the bread man. But last night, I also bought this guy named Joe Sakic. That is right. We ended up picking up Sakic for around 200 k Really, really good deal in my mind. Obviously, an elite center, and I, he's not even upgraded yet. Upgraded, he's even better. So, um, he has Fly the Zone, which is a really good synergy. And he has Snipe, which I think is probably one of the better X-Factors in the game. So, we got a couple new debuts here. Obviously, the Panarin, and we're trying out Sackney for the first time. Let's go, baby. 
I'm also making an impulse decision. I'm Brian Chris Chelios, my favorite player of all time on the squadron. I have so many right-handed D-men, but I couldn't pass. That's literally the first Chelios I've seen him for a decent price on my team for the rest of the year. I know, what a shame, man. We're only at 448K and have a base McDavid chilling. Ah, So I think for right now, I'm gonna get rid of Dougie Hamilton. Like, as much as I, I want to use my free X Factor, I got East. I got East Chelios. Come on. All right, we're going up against the Raven Clavers. He's got Brad Marchand, fully upgraded and X Factor activated. Why? Hello? All right, no pressure. Couple big debuts for the squadron here. Fox just got absolutely dominated by the freaking Islanders. So hopefully I play better than them. Oh my god, hello, Papega. Oh my god, Papega. I'm looking like the IRL Hawks now. David gets by him. Oh, what a pass, Connor McDavid, dude. He's unreal. I may not have the X Factor, but he is so freaking good. That 90 McDavid is so good, dude. He's unreal. All right, first game for upgraded Panarin. Like I said, I've, I've really liked his base card, so here's hoping. And I really didn't like Pasta, so I'm glad I got him over Pasta, I will be honest. Michael still has it, waiting for something, anything. To the point, Adam Foot over to Raymond Bork. I have to change his number. Oh, Adam Foot, what did I keep, dude? That was actually nuts. Cross crease, just kidding. Bang. Oh, I gotta hit the net. Who does he have a net? It looks like he has a Vegas goalie number 35. I have no idea. Oh, big toe drag. Oh, I, well, I thought I had taste for a split second there. I don't know if I would have made that pass like the in the last video with the Gretzky pass, though. Patty Kane. Gretzky, oh, the backhand. Antiranta, he has a net. Antiranta, why does he have like gold on his pads then? That's weird. All right, first line beauty's back out here. I need a heavy clap bomb, to be honest. I'm kind of feeling it from Adam Foot. Just kidding. Oh, what a read. Nate Mac. Nate Mac, how did I not score that Antiranta? Killing me, Antiranta. Killing me, Antiranta. Pretty good opening first for the Nopi side 20 of those. Obviously, nice play. My Connor McDavid there over to Nate McKinnon. But Aaron hasn't really done much, and Chelios hasn't. Neither is Sackick, to be honest. All right, big second period. We're starting with our Temi out here. I kind of want to see the leg kick. Will we actually see it? I, I think we will. I think we'll see a leg kick. Wainer over to Panarin. Panarin, that was a hot pass. I don't know if he would have received that, to be honest. Panarin, coast to coast. Kind of thinking about it, to be honest. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, oh, if Panarin got that coast to coast, even though it was like the slowest coast to coast ever, that would have been gross. Truculence, let's go. He lost his stick. How? He held my stick. That's holding. That's ridiculous. Gotta clamp down a little bit, dude. That's a ridiculous call, in my honest opinion. All right, back going on the PK. Don't call me Subban. Not great. Oh, my God, what a save. Oh my god, Vasilevsky's nuts. I think that's the first time I've ever seen Contortionist. Oh my goodness gracious. Replay that, Eric. Replay that. Oh my god, what a save. I'll have to go back and watch that, but oh my god. I have never seen an animation like that. I'm telling you, man. Goalie's actually kind of mad at this here. Low key. Oh, Panarin with a great poke. Go, Artemi. What a pass! Oh my, Artemi Panarin's buzzing. Panarin down low, over to Gretzky. Oh, I wish Gretzky kept going out and opened up a little bit more. Panarin's gonna read this. Oh, I read that, I just couldn't get the bounce. Oh, Panarin. Yo, Panarin's buzzing defensively though. Oh, imagine. Michael, down low, looking for anything. The point, nice pass, Jack. Very cool, that's why Buffalo's 3-0 without you. Wayne. Point. Adam Foot, bang. That almost counted. All right, we're buzzing, man. I'm feeling good. All right, man. We're kind of buzzing. I'm feeling good. I just, I can't score this year. It's by far my biggest issue. I cannot score. I gotta score. I gotta. All right, biggest third period of the Don't Be Sound 20s career. Let's go. Tighten up. Play good hockey. Score some freaking goals, please. I've also yet to use McDavid's one timer because he's normally the passer. Oh, that's not great. That's not great. That's not great. Andre? He made the save, still went in. That is not great. Oh, I need a stick lift there. Oh, Gretzky. 
Big save, Vassy. Is that Jones? Patty Kane, what a pass by Patrick Kane on the shorthanded chance. Truculence. Nice. What? What happened? Hello? What? Why? What happened? What? What was the whistle? I'm I'm lost. Oh, what a windup! Great chance there. Great chance. I love how Matthews kind of opened up there. There's no way Seth Jones is bodying me. Seth Jones just absolutely dunked on my life. Tough scenes. Honestly, tough scenes. Tough scenes. I mean, honestly, like, I, I thought I would have a bump on him when he first came into the zone there, and I'm down by one. All right, we got a buzz, boys. We got a buzz. All right, Joe Sakic, Yager, and Eichel, we need something here. We need some magic, and we lose the draw. That is not what we needed. Eichel? Oh, my! Eichel barely misses that stupid wrap. Sakic? Hello? What? Huh? Why? What the f was that with Joe Sackick stick? Hello? I'm confused. What is happening with my player sticks? I'm so confused. What's poke? No, Jonathan Tish! Get it! Get it! Oh my god! Oh my god. Give me a radio back! Give me something, dude! I deserve a goal. Alright. 32 seconds left. I need a win draw here. And we lose it. That's tough scenes. Get a hit. Truculence gets it. Let's go. 18 seconds. I need a hit. And he gets a GWG. That's a tough scene, man. Dude, I can't score an NHL 22. I don't know what it is, man. I No matter what, I can't score a short side. I can't score anything, man. I, I'm terrible offensively. So 15 seconds left. Honestly, not a great debut from Panarin. He was actually, he felt pretty good, but man, I, I'm, I'm offensively struggling lately. I, I'll be honest. And just like that, we fall in the debut for Panarin and Sackick. And hey, you know what? Pay to lose, baby. Pay to lose. All right, that's a tough one. Like I said, Panarin, I mean, who scored? Who's my only goal? It was McKinnon. Yeah, McKinnon from McDavid. So I don't know, man. Not a, not a crazy game. I mean, Gretzky, Gretzky, Panarin, and Kane had the most ice, ice time out of all my forwards. Um, Sackick didn't really do much either, dude. I mean, I don't know, man. I, I'm terrible offensively. I gotta, I gotta figure it out. So that is gonna be it for this one. Hopefully you guys did enjoy another X Factor pack. Let me know down below if I make the right choice. I think, I, I'm pretty sure I did. But either way, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did, let me know all the time.